2015 season is now one third of the way through as we look back at the top five plays of the week for round six. And coming in at number five is Hurstbridge midfielder Riley Redding. Despite being brushed aside in an earlier attempt to tackle, Redding didn't give up on the chase as he brought down Thomas Downs' James Rosolio. It was another thriller at J.E. Moore Park as Altham overcame West Preston Lakeside, but Roosters forward Aaron Willits makes the highlights package, flying into oncoming traffic to take this pack mark. He's been a regular in this year's Plays of the Week highlights, and McLeod high flyer Lucas Hobbs was at it again, reigning in this big mark as his side overcame lower plenty by 43 points. Panton Hill recorded its second victory of the season with a big win over Mernda, and the highlight was this team goal capped off by Thomas Blake. Nathan Hendry and Tyler Scarce worked hard in the lead up before Blake put through a check side from deep in the forward pocket for one of his three goals. And coming in at number one this week is who else but Bandura's Gary Moorcroft. Renowned for his high marking, Moorcroft was at it again at the weekend, thrilling the crowd with this huge leap over reigning Premier Greensborough. Well done to Gary Moorcroft, the number one play of the week for round six. And remember, you can nominate your highlights from the senior action for the Plays of the Week package. Simply go to northernfl.tv and fill in the highlight nomination form. <laughs>